Are you currently participating in NaNoWriMo? Great, then this video is for you. If you're currently halfway through writing your 50K novel but feel stuck and unsure how to go on, be sure to stick around for some tips and tricks. Let's get started. Hey guys, Noor here and welcome back to my channel! And for those visiting for the first time, hello, I'm the fantasy author of the novel Divinity Falling. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe for weekly writing advice videos. So I'm gonna be honest, I'm not participating in NaNoWriMo. I've tried it in the past but got overwhelmed immediately. I'm a very slow plotter and writer and so NaNoWriMo just doesn't suit me. However, just because it doesn't work for me doesn't mean that it's not great for other writers. In fact, I know several writers who do really really great doing NaNoWriMo. And just because I'm not participating in NaNo doesn't mean I don't have some tips for you. After all, these tips apply to all writers, whether they're participating in NaNo or otherwise. So if you're feeling stuck halfway through NaNo and not sure how to continue with your story, don't worry. This is totally normal. Remember that you're writing a novel in 30 days, so the planning process is kind of rushed. Now, if you planned your story before you began NaNo, then you're probably doing better. But if you started thinking of your story right when NaNo started, then you most likely did so quickly and with little time to digest everything. But don't freak out, that's totally okay. Here's what you do. Tip number one, if you're feeling stuck, simply stop writing. Yes, I know, this is NaNo and the whole point is to keep writing. But hear me out, you don't want to write nonsense just to increase your word count. Or maybe you do, but will that help you in the long run? No, no it won't. Besides, taking a small break from writing isn't going to destroy your NaNo progress. Simply stop writing, even if it's just for an hour or two, and analyze why you're stuck. Are you bored of the story? Or are you facing a plot hole? Or perhaps the conflict hasn't even started yet and you're halfway done with your book. No matter what you discover during this analysis phase, work with it. If you're bored of your own story, figure out why and add elements that you find exciting. And if there are plot holes, tackle them before moving forward. You could also skip over the plot holes and continue with the story as if they've been resolved, saving the plot holes work for later. And if you haven't written a conflict yet, then you don't have a story. Figure out a conflict and either go back to implement it at the start, or jump in where you left off as if you've written the conflict. Then at the end of NaNo, you could go back and fix the first half so that it's tailored around the conflict. Tip number two, tell your inner critic to shut up. This is honestly not just for NaNo, but I think it applies here. Our inner critic often tells us that we're doing bad when that might not be the case. So if you're stuck and not feeling motivated to continue because you're worried that your writing sucks, then tell that inner critic of yours to shut up. You're not writing a flawless novel. That's not at all what NaNo's about. You're writing a messy, rushed novel. Your goal is to finish it with all or most of its bones intact, so you can revise later and add in the flesh. So don't be discouraged. Your inner critic isn't always right. So that's all I have for you today. I hope this video helps you out whether you're participating in NaNo or not. I'd love to know, how's your NaNo progress going? Let me know in the comments. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. I put out weekly writing advice videos that will take your story to the next level. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media to see what I'm up to from day to day and to chat with me. And before we go, I just want to give a quick shout out to Sarah Frain, Lori B, and Alan J. Early for my shout out to you over on Patreon, as well as all my amazing patrons. You guys are so awesome. Thank you so much for your support. And remember, nor for presidents.